Sonic Unleashed includes a collection of extra side missions known as the Hot Dog Missions. These missions are split into four different categories, Ring Trial and Battle Trial during the day, Survival Trial during the night, and a Time Trial for both day and night. A hot dog stand can be found in every location in the game, including Eggman Land, but today we are going to focus on the missions found in Apatos. Apatos is without question the easiest set of hot dog missions with very short stages to complete, these stages being Act 2 of the daytime stages and Act 1 of the nighttime stages. Let's start with the nighttime stages. I'll discuss the strategies, then play the clips. For the survival mission, you are given a very small amount of health to complete the level. It's equivalent to half of the level 1 life meter. While it doesn't seem like much, the enemies in Apatos don't deal that much damage, so if you can beat the enemies fast enough, you're unlikely to take any damage at all. I completed this trial with strength level 7, and this level was plenty enough to destroy the smaller enemies using attacks with area of effect. As for the slightly bigger enemies, using the YYXX combo is pretty much guaranteed to take down the purple monsters or the shielded badniks. You can also use a running jump into X or Y to deal a lot of damage and clear out the space too. In the final area, you can just activate your unleash ability and tear the enemies apart with whatever combo you'd like. I'd recommend just going for the big guy as he's the only required enemy to defeat in this area. Once he's down, the gold ring appears. When it comes to the time trial, it's important that rather than going as fast as humanly possible, that you just make sure you aren't wasting any time. If the enemies aren't in your way and they're not blocking you off from the next area, don't bother fighting them. Attacks like your running jump Y are great at clearing out areas while keeping you moving. This move is great at the first lever and when you reach the open pathway, since defeating the enemies in these areas is not a requirement. In some areas that are closed off by enemies, sometimes only a specific selection of the enemies needs to be beaten. In this case, the three basic grunts in the garden and the mini boss at the end. In climbing sections, you can use a few methods to speed things up. When you grab a ledge, jumping before you actually reach it will have Sonic jump as soon as he gets there, saving you from having to climb up. You can also use the XXA combo mid-air to give you a lot of forward momentum, but just don't do it after a single running jump. To save you the annoyance of watching two videos showing the exact same thing, I'll just show the time trial. Since no damage was taken during either of them, the strategies can be carried over to your own playthroughs.
Now let's get into the day stages, starting with the battle trial. The main thing you need to remember in the battle trial is that there's no time limit. You can absolutely take your time to choose to pass with more enemies. Apatos doesn't have many different paths like the later stages do, but the main area you should remember is the big gap with the flying enemies. You can't stay here to farm them as they respawn, but if you take your time to beat all of them at least once, you'll have pretty much guaranteed the 25 enemy takedowns required for this stage, so long as you don't deliberately miss the rest of the enemies. The time trial only gives you 2.5 minutes to beat the stage. To many players this time is not generous at all, but I'll make this easy for you. While things like the rainbow rings and the launchers may look pretty in gameplay, they more often than not will actually cost you time instead of saving it. In some situations it's quite easy to skip them and move on. Excluding the start of the stage, take the top paths when you can as these are often much faster. And after this quick time event, hug the left wall as you boost to take a shorter path that will get you to the end much faster. Other than this, practice avoiding any damage as this will slow you down a hell of a lot. The ring trial asks for you to collect 300 rings. This isn't much for Apatos, so as long as you don't miss any of the open ones and boost through grouped up rings, you'll have absolutely no problem with this one. Since I collected the 300 rings in both other trials, I'll once again save you from watching something you've already seen.
And that's everything. If you try any of these strategies yourself, feel free to tell me how you get on. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like and also leave a comment below, I love reading them. As always, my name is Snack and I'll see you in the next one.